Hi everyone, in this video I will be talking about the all-important chat window. And it's mostly for those that always keep it closed, but I must tell you that the chat window is one of the most important parts of the game. Especially in group content. And I know, um, one of the most annoying things about it is, of course, zone chat. And if you've played any Star Trek Online at all, you'd know that it's rather nasty in there. But you'll notice also that I have nothing here, because I have zone chat turned off. And I will show you how to do that in this video. So before we do that, you'll notice there's different tabs and a zone tab. I'll talk about that in a bit. But click this button here, and you'll see all these options. And I will go through each of them before getting into chat settings. So of course, set channel to select the channel that you will chat in. Find a theme, also default key O. Fleet data, friends, emote tab, now it's all blanked out because we're in space. Notification settings for, well, notifications and fly-in. So chat would be if you have um, notifications turned on in chat, this is what these are. And fly-in is, um, for example, when somebody wins a lockbox. Yep. And I'm not going to talk about the mic settings because I don't know anyone that actually uses Star Trek Online's built-in uh, built voice chat. So let's go into chat settings. Now let me just enlarge this. So let's start off with chat options. So um, you can select to show date, show time. Helps me if I see a message and I want to know when it was sent in case I reply very late and then it's not relevant anymore. Channel names to just show you what channel something was fed in, and it helps out. Sticky channels, well, it is what it is. <laughs> uh, system message types, account names, that helps out. If, the, um, if you're on PC, it's the app and then their name. Profanity filter, I usually keep it off, I don't really care. But sometimes for YouTube, I have it on just to protect myself from possible demonetization, <laughs> and the rest of that. Okay, so in your chat window, you have different tabs, and in each tab, you can have different settings. And of course, you can turn things on and off, so I got zone chat off, of course, you can turn it on again, but I keep it off for this specific tab. And here, you can color code them. But of course, with the show chat names option in chat um, options, it makes it a little less confusing, but I always keep some things color-coded just to help out. Of course, you can open a new window if you want to. Oh, that was a new tab, but you can open a new window if you want to. But I usually just stick to one window. And for me, the most important thing is especially where is it? Team chat. Because when you're doing a random TFO or any group content at all, and some people don't know what they're doing, it's the perfect way to communicate to them. Of course, unless your entire team is going through voice chat through Discord, for example, then yeah, that. But when you're playing a random TFO, it's with random people. If you're not on a team already, please, please, please use team chat just to get the the TFO done in a timely and successful manner. Alright, let's go into the channels tab. So here you can join custom channels. If you're invited to one, you can click the join button. If you're inside one, you can click the leave button. And if you're... If you can administrate the channel, you got the admin button. And of course you can join or create channels, though I don't know, this random channel name and just create it where you will be the owner of that channel, you can control what happens. And uh, I'm an operator in this channel, so... <clears throat> I got specific functions and stuff, but here is different levels and what they can do. So I'm not the admin or the owner, but I have some... access, so I can mute and kick, but uh, that's it, right? 
And of course, if you do have the ability to administrate a panel, you can invite people. So I'm just typing a random thing in, but yeah, you can invite people. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much it for this video. And I do keep a zone chat, just when I'm a bit curious, but no, I almost never go there. So yeah, that's it for this video. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe and ring the notification bell to be notified of future videos. Helps out the channel quite a lot. That's reason, so why not? And the, the subscribe button, if you haven't already, is just below the video. Or my huge um, profile picture that shows up in that area. And if you want to support me in a different way, I do have my Patreon in the description. And if you want to join my currently very small Discord channel, that's in the description below. See you guys next time. Bye.